Hi! Welcome back to another Genshin Impact video. Call me Papa Lace because it's kind of kinky and I'm gonna keep this one short. Stop believing bullshit rumors and content creators and everyone else is doing this. Stop spreading it. Like Jesus Christ, I've never played a game with so much misinformation and rumors and baseless bullshit based on leaks and gut feelings. Like, oh, I, I feel like that's how it works, guys. Like. And if you're gonna talk about it, at least provide a little bit of substantial information. Content creators, I get it, y'all wanna be the first to break the news. But god damn it doesn't do so much damn harm to the community because... Because you could literally be setting people off on a journey for hours and hours seeking something that isn't actually there. Case in point, this bad boy at launch spread like wildfire. The most notable point was that the pity was gonna be changed from 90 to 50 pulls and when you hit pity you would get a five star weapon and a five star character selector <laughs> there's nothing wrong with discussing possible rumors and all that but at least add the caveat and i don't know why but like everyone was just so convinced that it was going to happen and it's so sad because i was actually kind of convinced too alas it obviously didn't happen Mihoyo went on to make 250 mil in the first month and here we are. And I guess my resilience to bullshit and readiness to believe just shot up and dropped like 90 levels after starting this game. Now onto a more recent rumor which is that chests respawn. TLDR, there is no evidence that they do. Up until recently, a whole bunch of people were actually reporting that chests respawn because like, well... <sighs> I found this chest over here, but I swear I didn't get it. I, I felt I felt like I would have gotten it if I'd seen it. So therefore it must be a respawn. Or like it was in broad daylight. It's it's gotta be a respawn, right? It must be a respawn. No, no. You see, that gave me hope as well. <laughs> And it set me and a couple of my friends off for a couple of hours searching for respawns, running respawn paths. But they don't respawn, okay? They might spawn. Evidence just says that they don't respawn. People have done several tests, like actual empirical tests. Look, that's just how it is, you know? I live and I learn, and I hope you do too. Now, there are times where things are tested thoroughly, but they do end up changing. For example, crit rate. The crit rate cap on CBT was discovered to be capped, soft capped rather, at 80%. What this means is that even if you hit 100% crit rate, you would only be critting about 80% of the time. And this was tested on CBT. Now on live servers, we're actually seeing that the crit rate and the actual crit and the actual critting is aligned. So if you have a crit rate of 100%, you'll be critting 100% of the time, which is great, you know? Why would you have a soft cap? Like, <laughs> moral of the story is sometimes things do change, but maybe let's stop spreading shit for clout because y'all know it's for clout and maybe just have something to back it up rather than your feelings. Like I said, short one today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it, learned something. You already know what to do, like, subscribe. I know I haven't made a video on like yonks, but I'll, I've been moving houses. You can, if you can tell, my background is a bit different. But again, as always, thanks for watching and I hope you guys stick around for the next one.